Hello YouTubers, fellow hams, and RVers. Well, quite a while back I built my own Wi-Fi extender. Some of you have probably seen that video. And uh, I promised back then a field test at a Walmart, uh, which was kind of why I built it. I built it for when I'm parked in an RV park or when I'm overnighting at a Walmart to get better Wi-Fi uh, from a distant source. Usually you're at the back of the parking lot in a Walmart, for example. Well, recently, uh, I took a drive up to Parker, Arizona to resupply on groceries at the Walmart, and I filmed a test of the Wi-Fi extender. Now, I'm really enjoying my time out here in the desert. Um, the southwest Arizona desert is absolutely beautiful and remote, RF quiet. Uh, often, there is so little noise on the band that the S-meter doesn't even move, and you think your antenna is disconnected until a signal comes blasting through. It's beautiful out here. I love it. The sunsets are astounding. The sky is huge, only obscured by the mountains at the horizons. It's a beautiful place. So uh, anyway, I'm still here. Uh, I drove up to Parker and uh, did the uh, Wi-Fi extender test, got my groceries, and I came back out here into the desert for a little while. Uh, pretty soon, though, I am going to have to move north. It's starting to get hot. Uh, today, in fact, it's going to be in the mid-90s. A uh, couple of days of that, and then we're back to the uh, low 80s. Uh, Fahrenheit. Uh, sorry about that for you guys that are on Celsius. Anyway, um, I got to the Walmart and uh, parked at the back of the parking lot, as you usually do, and surprisingly, it was closed. There was a water main break in Parker, and most of the restaurants and stores were closed for a while. Well, I thought, well, I'm here. I might as well test out the extender anyway. So, I fired it up, pointed it at Walmart, and, uh, well, here's what happened. All right, I've got my antenna pointed out the window in the direction of Walmart. I'm connected to the bridge on the Wi-Fi extender. Let's, uh, let's see, site survey, site survey. There it is, site survey. Let's see if it finds Walmart's Wi-Fi. As you can see from the scanner on the tablet, the signal's pretty low. I couldn't even see it on the laptop Walmart Wi-Fi. Do I want to connect? Yes, I do. Now we wait for the uh, bridge to reboot, and we'll see if we're connected. Okay, uh, let's see, security should be none. Let's make sure we're not Security mode. No, okay. No passphrase, so we should be connected. Let's go look at the status and see if we have a link. Walmart Wi-Fi, channel 11, link quality zero. There we go. Okay, we've got a connection. Why am I not getting an address, Walmart? I fiddled around for a little while trying to get any internet through Walmart's Wi-Fi. I thought maybe my extender was giving me problems. It turns out, no, Walmart's Wi-Fi was down. I took my tablet right down to the building and connected and I could still not get on the internet. This is a possibility, uh, but fortunately, as with most Walmarts, they're in an area with a lot of stores. And so I went back to the site survey, and if we look at that, we can see Subway Guest is in the list. Looking out the front window of the rig, I could see the subway. It was down the street and across the other side of the road a little ways. Quite a distance. Would the Wi-Fi extender be able to connect to it? Let's see. I had absolutely no problem at all connecting to the subway, even though they're so far away. However, the speed was not great. My Wi-Fi extender antenna was at the back of the rig, pointing all the way through the RV, so I decided to move it. Okay, here we go, with the antenna now at the front of the rig, pointing out the windshield. 
at the subway, which is down the road and across the street, much better. Oh yeah, <clears throat> much, much better. What about upload speed? Let's see. Yeah, not enough to do a live stream. Um, I really wouldn't trust it anyway. I'd really like to get connected to Walfart, Wal Walfart, <laughs> Walmart's Wi-Fi, but even with the tablet up by the building, I wasn't getting an internet connection. So this it still proves the concept. I mean, I'm quite a ways away from that subway, as you saw from the picture. Uh, so uh, this is a usable connection. So as you can see, the extender worked exactly as I designed it to work. I'm very happy with its performance. Um, while I was waiting for the Walmart to reopen, I was able to binge watch a little YouTube and uh, catch up on some of the YouTube channels that I like to follow. Um, I unfortunately can't really waste bandwidth on watching uh, YouTube or, or such when I'm out here in the desert using the cell phone. Got to save that bandwidth for uploading videos. Uh, so uh, yeah, a successful test. Um, as I start to travel more uh, through the summer, and I have to stop at places, um, I'll be guaranteed of getting a good Wi-Fi signal uh, regardless of the, uh, of the scenario. So I'm, I'm pretty happy with the result. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, if you're not already a subscriber, click to subscribe. Join us on the Facebook channel for discussion about the videos. And if you'd like to help support this channel, please click to support me on my Patreon page.